So I'm here, sitting here doing a walk and talk with Photo Mom. Mm -hmm. uh, first, Jim, thanks for uh, doing this for, with me. Not a problem. Uh, go ahead and introduce yourself. Okay, my caching name is Photo Mom. My name is Jim Hoffman. I've been caching since uh, mid-2003 and uh, enjoying it, uh, particularly since I retired several years back. And how'd you get to the name Photo Mom? Uh, my my wife is uh, likes to, likes photography, and she had an AOL ID called Photo Mom at AOL. And her brother thought we would enjoy caching, so he signed us up under her name. And I enjoy the caching, and she's so so with it. She just likes doing a couple now and then. Very good. Well, it looks like a beautiful area we're going, and we got with a lot of people. Let's go ahead and catch up with them. Okay, great. Where's your GPS? Right there. Oh, okay. the okay, mine's right there. Okay. So, Photo Mom, looking at your profile, you have some extraordinary numbers. Tell me about some of them. Well, uh, I'm up to, uh, I'm coming up on 85,000 caches this next week, so that'll be a good one. And I've hidden just under 2,000. My, my main hides are out in the desert. I did a 1,000 cache trail and a 400 cache trail. That's a Jeep trail out there. So that's where most of my numbers come from, but it's... What are the name, what's the name of your uh, power trails that you said? Uh, the Heart of the Mojave, and the other one is called CCX4, which is just uh, cache by fouring. It was four-wheel drive caching. Very good. So we're going to catch up, but uh, when we get to the next one, I'm going to ask you about uh, your extraordinary numbers by states. Okay, happy to talk about it. All right. So a lot of people have gotten all states. Tell us about your experience getting all of your states. Well, about seven years ago as I was driving across country, I decided to start working on doing a hundred caches in each of the states. And it took me seven years to complete it, but this last uh, May after Geo Woodstock, I went to Connecticut and in Rhode Island and got my last two states to complete 100 caches in all 50 states plus the District of Columbia. <laughs> that, that's amazing. Um, so are you going to do a challenge? And... Uh, I've considered it. I don't know yet. I'm, I'm going to think about it. Uh, I might try to do one that does either it gives you a choice of 150 states or 510 states or 1,005 states but I need another state at 1,000 and one more state at 500 in order to complete those myself. So once I get those completed, then I'll think about a challenge. <laughs> That's amazing numbers there. Uh, they're just amazing numbers. All right. Yeah. Well, on we go. Okay. <laughs> All right, photo mom, accomplished a lot. Where are we going? What's next? Well, um, next is we're gonna, you know, hopefully do a power run in the near future, but we're not sure exactly where yet. And then we're gonna go to uh, Woodstock in uh, Fort Worth and do a whole bunch of uh, puzzle caches. So those are the next two things on the horizon. All right, and you were telling me that you probably can get a thousand geocaches in Texas. Yeah, we're hoping to get about a thousand in Texas when we're there for uh, Woodstock. Well, very good. Well, Jim, thanks very much again for participating. This has been very interesting. I know that you're, uh, a lot of people have heard the name, seen the name, and now they get to know you. Yeah, I'm a surprise to a lot of people because a lot of people are expecting something completely different when they hear the name Photomon. <laughs> very good. Well, thanks again. Okay. Thank you.